Hello. Uh, what's up, Obsessed? Hi. Mr. K. How do you do? Hello, hello. Uh, I need to get some water. I am like really thirsty right now. So give me a second. up chat oh, fuck I've been so busy I've had no time to myself today are you gonna make me dinner Phil you gonna buy me dinner What's up, Ty? Hi. Well, they're not cold. They're more like room temperature, you know? Ty, Crystal. Oh, Rex, you're first. Congrats. What's up, Lukey? Goodbye, Crystal. Um, 
Hi, Queen. Hello. I'm, um... Ugh. It's been a long day for me. So, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a bit in my feels right now. So, I'm a bit sensitive at the moment. Uh, I got, ex I got an extension on my paper. So, uh, I don't have to do it until next Monday, which is really nice. Yeah. Um... I'm kind of in my feels. We, uh, I had class. The reason why I'm late is because I had class. I'm just letting you guys know. So I finished class at about 10. And then I went to the grocery store because my sister needed me to get things for Thanksgiving. So I just went right to the grocery store. Um, thank you, Ty. Uh, I'm actually staying home. My sister is going to be doing Thanksgiving. And my mom's gonna be coming over. My mom's making like the pie and stuff. And my sister is doing like the dinner. I was actually kind of thinking about making ice cream. We already bought ice cream, but I thought it'd be I I thought it'd be kind of fun to like hand make the ice cream. So maybe I'll go over to my mom's like tomorrow or when uh, on Wednesday. I'll go over to my mom's on Wednesday. And I'll help her cook the make the pie. I'll like stream and everything. I'll uh, I'll do the pie stream and then as well as like I want to hand make ice cream. I think it'd be kind of fun. I've never done it before. I did it once when I was younger, but it like wasn't the same, you know. It's okay to not be okay. Know that you're gonna. Yeah, I'm not like I'm not like s upset right now or anything, but uh, in my class my my the one class that i have it's like a supervision class we talked about like pretty personal stuff related to just you know our therapy and everything and it kind of just got me like thinking about just life and um yeah it was like some really touchy subjects so and then i'm not gonna lie the the colorado thing has really gotten under my skin which is very which is very odd for me because i'm normally a very i'm normally a very distant person as in like there's a lot of like really shitty things that happen you know like a lot of people dying and things and normally i'm really good at just kind of being like well it is what it is, but I, I guess like today, today and like yesterday, I've been like really in my feels. So, and in not a bad way, and not a, like a bad way at all. So, just like it is what it is, you know. So, I'm I'm not gonna be streaming for very long today. I wanted to sign on and say hello though, because it is Monday, and uh, I know I'm usually here pretty late. So. I'm sorry to hear that, Queen. Big hugs all around. I agree. I agree. Big hugs all around. And if you would like to make fun of me for my SpaghettiOs, you may. But unless you're going to buy me dinner, you really have no word to say anything. I have been so fucking busy today. I have done so much paperwork today. Um... That's okay. No, no, no worries. No worries. But please, no banana wafers for the love of God. Well, I I was grocery shopping. I needed to get wine for my sister. My sister needed me to get like a bunch of different wines and stuff for cooking and then for drinking for Thursday. And I was like, I saw them and I was like, damn, it's been a long time since I've had SpaghettiOs. And I... I'm I'm very hungry and I don't like I want to go to bed by like one ish so I was like I'm just gonna buy them and eat them I don't really care I know I'm gonna feel like shit though tomorrow <laughs> they always make me feel really gross what's up Swift hi if I am ever in Toronto well that'd be very nice Mr. K thank you it's a treat to get a moment to connect and decompress. Yeah, 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 I agree. I, I did a lot of decompressing today. Um, 
It also has me thinking that, like, I'm kind of sad to, like... I graduate in two weeks. So, it kind I'm kind of sad to, like, leave my clients and stuff. Good night, Schultz. I appreciate you, buddy. Oh, thank you, Schultz. Yeah, I, I graduate... Um, my last day is the 8th. So. Yeah, I'm doing all right. I'm a, I'm a little in my, I'm a little in my feels today. I'm, I'm, I was like, just letting people know. The Eyed. The Eyed of December, yes, yes. I don't know, is is the stream freezing for anybody else? I don't know. Um Yeah, hi. I wanted to sign on and say hi. I told you guys that I'd be live. Um Aid, I didn't say aid, it's the Eid. Right? The Ides of March, no? Something like that? Am I wrong? I have no clue. I have I don't even know what we're talking about. Uh take some time yourself. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'd really like a massage, low key. I'm not gonna lie. I might, I might try to go get a massage on Wednesday. Oh no, I want to do the stream. I have to do cooking. Shits. Eid. Is that what you mean? Eid. I don't know. Eid is. Oh, 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 oh. I, I did not know that, at all. Actually, I don't know anything. I'm very ignorant. I'm a working girl? I guess so. I'm working for free. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're gonna be doing, um... My mom's gonna be baking a pie, apple pie, and I would like to help her. And then additionally, I would like to try to hand make ice cream. I think it'd be really fun to try to hand make ice cream. And I heard that it's really simple, and I'm sure it tastes awesome too, so. Oh, I already cut my finger today. Like, legit. It actually healed pretty well. I, I can't even show you. It's a lot of churning. Can't you use a blender? Am I wrong? Am I gonna do another Thanksgiving stream? Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. However, my sister's gonna be doing the turkey this year. My sister's doing the majority of the cooking this year. You made ice cream in a bag? Well, I'd have to make enough ice cream for one, two, three, four, five, six people so oh i'm sorry to hear that crystal roll it on the ground well we're gonna figure it out together we're gonna figure it out together Yeah, no, it sounds pretty nice, right, Lukey? How have you been, dude? Have you been streaming? Um, I don't even celebrate Thanksgiving. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna lie. I don't really like Thanksgiving. I like the food, but I don't like what it stands for. Like. I like the idea of there being a holiday in which we give thanks, gratitude. I think that that's really nice, but I don't like the fact that it's based around like Native American massacre. It feels very 
colonialist in like the worst kind of way, like a Columbus Day, but it's a Columbus Day that we all celebrate, you know? How's my magic quest going? Uh, what do you mean by that? <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Luki. But hey, yo, I, I mean, at least you're taking your time to yourself. I mean, that's really good. Uh, it's good that you're prioritizing your health, your mental health. It stands for thanking the natives who opened up their lands and gave it. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. The fools. Fools. I wonder... I wonder if history would have been different if the native peoples of America were immediately hostile from the very get-go. Do you think that, like... Do you think that, like, the moment that any sort of... S not settlers, but any, like, explorers or whatever, like, landed in the Americas, and if the natives were, like, immediately hostile and, like, killed them, do you think that, like... Do you think that colonialism would have still taken this land? I don't know. Hmm. But I, I don't like this holiday. It makes me feel very weird. <laughs> An overwhelming yes. Yeah, I, I do agree. Guns. But it's also kind of like... Okay, like, picture this, right? I mean, like, and I know this is like... I don't... I, one of you might know history be better than I do. But, like, they come over, right? They find the peoples. They then go back home with all the information of the peoples, right? And then, like, they're like, you know, they tell the king and queen, Queen uh, Isabella or whatever, like, hey, like, this is very easy for us to take. Let's just go over there and just kind of fucking take it. If instead they had all died and they never were able to return back to Europe, uh, it would have been a very different story, right? Because, like, it would have still been, like, undiscovered land. I don't know. I, I don't know. You know, you know what I'm talking about? Like, if instead they had all died and nobody returned back to Europe, maybe it wouldn't have. I don't know. You get a paid day off. <laughs> Bruh, fuck. I... I hate guns. Guns are so fucking stupid, dude. I hate guns. I really do. Personal opinion. You can like them all you want. You you do you. I won't I won't blame you or judge you for it. But god, they just scare me so much. I ha I was in the Walmart today and they were like doing restocking, so like a lot of the Walmart aisles were like really crowded. And one of the workers dropped a pallet and it made such a loud sound and I was like this is it. It's a gunshot. It's over. Like my like I, my my adrenaline started pumping, like fuck like why why does my instinct go to gunshot, like why? <laughs> like I've never even really like been around that kind of thing, but it's just like, what my instinct thought. It's like goddamn, fucking sucks. Guns suck. In video games, they're cool though. Yeah, well, I, I was subconsciously thinking about Colorado, or like unconsciously, you know? The colonizers were more subversive than that. Introducing addictive drugs. Well, yeah, I mean, that, that happened too. But that was, that was like, that was like a little bit later. Like introducing like alcohol and stuff to them. We actually read like a lot of articles about that, about um, the, the, how much of, like how we got the native peoples addicted so that they were easier to um, essentially stereotype and then manipulate and then force off their land. It's, it's, kind, it's very interesting. Very shitty, obviously, but... Uh, I mean, I don't really want to get political. I'm not going to lie. I'm not really in that kind of mood. I am kind of in my feels though, so. How you doing, bunnies, by the way? Hello. I didn't say hi.
so much what they are doing nowadays. Are they? Are, are we getting people addicted to substances? I have no clue. I don't know. Maybe. Mm. Read a book. Let's see. What's on my shirt? It's a uh, it's the game store that I uh, that I like. This is like the um, the the game store. So out of all of the magic stores in the area in Florida that I've been to, this has been the store that I like the most. They they have the best competitive scene in my opinion, and the people are really nice. They treat me really well, and they gave me the shirt for free. So I I asked them if they had any like a hat or anything and they were like yeah and they were like we don't have a hat but we'll give you a shirt and i said yeah sure and i was like how much and they said for free and i said oh cool so i'm gonna rep it it's more like i'm gonna use it as like a workout shirt i wouldn't really like wear this anywhere else um i don't wear i don't wear store shirts unless they pay me to but uh if they want to sponsor me for a tournament then i would wear them sure uh, my cats broke a perch today. <laughs> Getting a little chunky, huh? Uh, well, yeah. Time Twister is a Magic: The Gathering card. Actually, that's where the where the name comes from. It's one of Power Nine, actually. One of the nine the nine most powerful cards in Magic. Oh well, yeah, actually, the only um. Interestingly enough, the only uh, when uh, the only tournament that I did really, really well at that I um, I made like top eight and everything like it was like a big deal. I I repped the comic book store, which is a store in New Jersey that I'm a really big fan of. A lot of my friends go there and because I wore their shirt on camera and I made top eight, they paid me over a grand. <laughs> so when I'm saying like, I won't wear your shirt unless they pay me, I'm, I'm being very serious. <laughs> but I'll wear it for funsies, you know, like around my house, whatever. No biggie. Oh, magic is awesome. I highly recommend it. I highly, highly recommend it. Yeah, there is a seizure story, but that one's a bit different. Um, that one is... Um, I went, I went to Nashville, Tennessee for a team sealed tournament. And I wasn't supposed to go because my parents were for forbidding me for going to magic events because my grades were not good because I was an undergrad and I just like my grades were doing really, really bad. And I went anyway without them knowing. And then I had a seizure in the middle of my match and I woke up in the hospital and I had to call my parents and then tell them that I was in the uh, Nashville General Hospital. <laughs> and they were very, very mad at me. <laughs> I'm scared to pick up a new card game. What card game do you play right now? I'm not going to lie to you, and I and I mean this in the most genuine and serious way. I would drop every other card game and play Magic. It, it, it's Magic is, is the best game to learn in terms of just skills and whatever. But yeah, that's the that's the story. I, I it was like really it was really rough. I didn't like that tournament center either. Like I probably will never go to Nashville for another tournament. The 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 convention center smelled like horse shit. Like literal horse shit. And I think it's because they had like a rodeo or something recently, like before that event. It was very weird. You used to play Hearthstone back in the day, mostly legend. Bro, I'm telling you. Magic is the best card game, period. It it is it is it magic has provided me more than just it's given me like life skills. 
it's giving me life skills. It was the first. It was the first trading card game. I I would just if I were you, I'd download Arena and just fucking go for it. It's it's my favorite game. I've played a lot of different games. I've played Hearthstone, Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, Marvel Snap, Naruto, Dragon Ball Z. Um, card fight vanguard all these different card games and magic is still my favorite it's not close i mean i've been playing it for 10 years so i'm a bit biased but uh i mostly play legends of rutana and rutana and marvel snap oh my god uh I another you want to know another reason why I I'm in my feels, and and I I I went on a date on Saturday, and uh you know uh you talk about like s small talk but like about your life like what do you what do you what are you doing in life and like what you know. You know, oh, oh, you're in school. What are you in school for? Whatever, whatever. And I tell them, well, I, I, I stream, and then I'm also in school for, I'm, I'm in grad school. They're like, oh, what are you in grad school for? And I say, for mental health. And they go, oh, you're a therapist. And I say, yeah. And they're like, are you psychoanalyzing me right now? And I went, no. And then the entire fucking night. They assumed that I was psychoanalyzing them, and then the, it, it completely, like, ruined the date. And then I even talked with- I, I even was like, you know, it really sucks, because I, I, I was like, you know, my, my mom told me this. And I didn't really believe her, but she said that, like, when you tell people that you're a therapist, they're going to assume that you're psychoanalyzing them. When, in reality, we psychoanalyze people all the time, the only difference is that I have a degree in psychoanalyzing people. And it's like, I'm not, like, you know, I'm not going to do anything with it. You know, you, 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 you know, when you first looked at me, you had a first impression of me. You know, when you... When I, when you heard me speak, you know, you, you had your thoughts about me, like you heard my voice, like all these things, when you saw what I was wearing, like you're, like you're constantly analyzing people. You're just like doing it unconsciously, you know? And uh, it's just like, no, I, I, that's not in my bio bunnies. Maybe, maybe I, I guess I got to write my entire life story in my bio. I, I don't know. I don't know. So, it is what it is. It is what it is. You like jazz? Thanks for the follow, Soul Taker. I just don't want to be a therapist outside of when I have to be a therapist. I don't. I. It makes me very irritated. It makes me very irritated. Yo. Daddy. Daddy. Daddy? Yo, thank you so much. I really appreciate it, dude. Thank you. You, like you should that? you should say that on the date. That's a perfect line to explain it. Like wanting to be a therapist only when I'm a therapist. Yeah. It's kind of rough, but. You're not my dad. Yo, thanks, Beyonce. Thank you. That's your career choice, not who you are. But at the same time, it kind of is who I am. It's it's very hard to escape. I don't know. Nemad, why would I scream that? Will you give subs if I do? I'll do it for subs. 
Were they cute? I thought they were. But I'm not gonna lie, you will. How many subs? You gotta tell you got I I we have to lock it in. This point I'm tired of asking me about nurse. Yeah, I feel that. I feel it, Mr. K. Oh, 69. Okay, so I know you're not being serious, so I'm definitely not doing it. They, I thought that they were cute. Their teeth were kind of fucked up, though. I'm not gonna lie. You, you guys talk. You guys like ask me all the time, like what you know, like what do I look for in a partner? Nice teeth. Nice teeth. If your teeth are like gross, it's kind of a turn off. It's kind of it's kind of a big turn off actually for me. And I don't care if they're like veneers, you know, as long as they like look nice. Versus in crooked or yellow. I don't mind crooked as much as I mind like yellow. Do you know what I mean? I I have to know that like you take care of your teeth. Of oh, sec, thank you for the gifted sub, dude. Like I I brush my teeth twice a day and I floss every day. My nightly routine is brushing, then flossing, then mouthwash, and then whitening my teeth. I do that every night. Unless I don't have like my whitening kit, then I don't do it, but. Say it to Schwartz though. Where's Schwartz? I love you, Nemad. Or I love you, Schwartz. There you go. Yeah, I don't mind like crooked teeth as much. That could be like pretty that it can all be fixed. That's what I'm saying. Like, like if you know, if you don't like your teeth, you know, you, you can you, you can get them fixed. But it's just like, I don't know if you want. Here's the thing. If you want my mouth on your mouth, I have to want to put my mouth on your mouth. You get what I mean? You know what I mean? So if I feel like if I if if I put my mouth on your mouth and I feel like I'm going to get some weird funky stuff in my mouth, then I, I don't want to do that. <laughs> if that makes sense. I think so. Yeah, I think teeth caps can be attractive. Yeah, I, I, I like like the one in the middle. Sure. Yeah, I don't see why not. I'm pretty I'm pretty open. So thank you guys for the gifted subs. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Alex, I don't know who those people are, Freckles. I'm sorry. Thank you, CM. Thank you. Hello, Nightmare. I don't know. Is that like controversial? Am I? Is me liking people with good teeth controversial? Like, am I in the, am I in the minority for that? I will agree with that. I I will agree with that. I will agree that that teeth can be more of a sign of privilege. Absolutely. Absolutely. But at the same time, I, some people don't brush their teeth twice a day and some people don't floss. Uh, wait, 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 so wait, 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 we, I, since I can do this, I have a lot of power here. I have a lot of power here. 
And this is anonymous. I don't know who, if any of you participate. I, I want to know, I genuinely want to know how many of you floss your teeth. Vote. It's anonymous. Nobody will know. I'm very curious, though. Be honest. Be truthful. How many of you floss? daily I'll give it weekly if you floss your teeth once a week then you can say then you can say yes if you floss your teeth less than once a week then no but you have to genuinely floss Kind of related, but I was so surprised by the little marks you have under your lips from your piercings. It's the only thing you can't really see on stream, and it added to your whole vibe so much. Interesting. Expand. Expand. Is it, to it is, I think it's totally to want teeth that look good. There is a pretty large variation of natural tooth colors. Some people just kind of have less white teeth. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not, I'm, you don't, you don't, they don't got to be fucking mirrors or anything. How expand? How, why were you surprised? And how did it add to my vibe? As in like, you mean when you met me in person, no? And yes, I am eating SpaghettiOs at room temperature. If you're not going to buy me dinner, you can fucking suck it, all right? You can shove it. I'm so bad with keeping a flock in. I'm just lazy. It's about developing a pattern. It's about developing a pattern. I totally get it. Okay, so 11 of you voted, 6 of you said yes. That's cool. All right. No judgment if you don't. And, and the only reason... Because for a long time, I didn't either. So... Uh, I they're not really holes anymore. They're more like dots. They don't they don't go all the way through anymore. I'd have to re-pierce them. But I, I I don't really think about it, but I do sometimes wonder if the average person notices them and if the average person is able to, to like discern the fact that I had piercings at one point. You'll buy me dinner? All right, bet. I think we have a poltergeist. <laughs> like I do it when I eat certain foods. That see that makes sense. Like you like you um like you eat steak or you eat like meat and you get like yeah, like then sure, sure, sure. You just gotta start doing it. You just gotta like start doing it every night. It's kinda irritating. It really sucks, but Like, for me, I can't get into bed without knowing that I've brushed my teeth and flossed, but... If you don't use chapstick... I mean, I use chapstick, literally. They were super noticeable. I mean, this one's kind of noticeable. These two are also kind of noticeable too, but only like when I really point them out, like when I'm, when I'm over here, you can't really see them. I have to get really close. So I kind of like them. I'm not going to lie because it makes me feel like I still have them in a way. And I'll always be, uh, there will always be a part of me that's still edgy. There, there will always be uh, the edge lord Tyler deep down, you know. So I, I still get to live it. My luscious lips. 
<laughs> oh my god. You always thought they were freckles? I mean, can you really see them? You can't really see them. I'd be surprised if any of you knew that I had piercings without me actually saying it. I'd be surprised, like genuinely. How soft my lips are? I don't think it's a weird compliment. I think it's only a weird compliment if the lips are like not attached to your face, you know? Or if like, I don't know, if they were like feeling them with their hands or something, they're like, wow. Even then, I don't even think it'd be that bad. Wow, your lips are so soft. Can I have them? Can I have them? Oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Wow, your skin looks very comfortable. Oh, Lily's fucking licking herself. She's going to town. You like jazz? She's going to town. <laughs> All right, chat. I'm uh, I'm not gonna lie. I'm I'm kind of sleepy. Um. No, I never finished my paper. My paper, I got I got an extension to next Monday. Next Monday. So, that was very nice. My my professor is awesome. I I love him. He is one of the nicest guys. I I actually I I texted him on Saturday. And I said, "On a scale of 1 to 10, how angry/disappointed would you be if I turned in my KPI?" key performance indicator next monday and he said that's fine and i responded you're a scholar and a saint and i thought i was the one that made miracles happen so and he gave me a thumbs up This weekend, I'm almost, I'm, I'm over halfway done. I'm over halfway done. I'm, I'm like 65% finished. So. Charm will take you far. Teeth will keep you there. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where my teeth have brought me. My charm has definitely carried me at, in some instances. I agree. My grad school experience has been very different than my undergrad experience. Grad school has been so chill. They don't give a fuck about a thing. As long as you communicate and you don't lie to them, they don't care. You think so? Do you think my teeth got me into grad school? That would make sense. That'd make a lot of sense. That's why they needed the dental chart for the application. Duh. Fuck, I didn't put that together. Good night, Lukey. Yeah, it's almost sleepy time for me too. It is almost sleepy time for me too. I am, I am, uh, I'm a sleepy boy. 
What's up, Jomian? Don't let us keep you up. Yeah, how fucking dare you, chat? Uh. <laughs> That's true, Somber. That's true. That's too true. Too close to home. That sounds very nice, Kay. That sounds very nice. I, uh... I'm so tired. <sighs> no, I didn't. I don't know what that is, bunnies. <laughs> I love you guys. It's a YouTube channel. All right, I'll check them out. Twitch Prime, what's that? Oh, great question. Great question. I don't know. It's a good question though. If I knew it, it'd be an even better question. All right, chat. If that is your real name. <sighs> it's bedtime. She's fucking going at it, huh? Ugh. All right. I love you. I like my outfit. It's it's just fucking shorts and a. I gotta get more short shorts. Uh, they're in. I I'm telling. They're in. Short shorts are in. I I've been sold on them ever since I got these. I gotta get more. Um. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Normal stream schedule this week. Um. Tomorrow I'll have to end stream a little early because I have to wake up really early tomorrow. And then Wednesday, I should be streaming, I think, earlier than normal if I'm going to be cooking with my mom, which I haven't, like, fully locked in yet. But if I am, I'll be live earlier than normal. And then Thursday, uh, I assume I'll be live, but I don't want to, like, I don't want to lock it in. Here, here's how I assume Thursday is going to go. Thursday is going to be a fucking wacky, wild day of of helping my sister prepare. And then there are most likely going to be. A, 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 an amount of, of um, a, a, a legal substance in New Jersey. Not so much in Florida. And if that's the case, then I might not be streaming on Thursday. So I'm uh, just just, uh, you know, uh, CYA covering covering my ass, cover your ass, so to say. So, um, normal, 
I, I, I will be live tomorrow at 9 p.m. Wednesday, I think I'll be live probably earlier than 9 p.m. Thursday, unsure. And then Friday, I will be live at 9. So. So. All right. Uh, fuck. Uh, I'm going to go to bed. Or at least get off stream. I love you. Follow me on Twitter. I also made a um, Hive. I know there's like a bunch of people that are like making Hive accounts. Uh, I made one. Up to you. If you want to follow me, I guess. Uh, it's just XDAD. That's why I, like, I hopped on it so I could just grab that username. Um, but if I don't, I don't really care. Follow me or not. It's up to you. Your choice. Um, I'll be back on tomorrow. Uh, it'll be a longer stream than this one, most likely, but it'll be shorter. So probably like two hours ish. Well, it was a lot easier to make a hive account. I literally just like hopped on it. So, all right, all I love you. Have a beautiful evening. Uh, shout outs to infamous for the three months uh anonymous with a gifted and upset with a gifted it means a lot thank you um i will shall I, shall I turn on goodbye sugar yeah fuck it i will all right all right uh i will see you all tomorrow goodbye sugar is active and um until until next time until tomorrow your advice yeah cover your ass i mean that's a good one that cya is a piece of advice that i got from grad school talking about my profession cya stands for cover your ass and it's mostly because there's a lot of like weird legal stuff when it comes to therapy but I think that it applies to things outside of therapy, too. Just pretty much be prepared for be prepared for the worst to happen. Yeah, when 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 it's possible, I guess that's what that's what that really means. Cover your ass. So that's your advice. That's a good one. I like that. I like that. Expect the best prepare for the worst. Yeah, sure. Absolutely. I just like cover your ass because like in reality, it's like I don't even like necessarily prepare for the worst, but it's more just like if something were to happen, at least I'm safe, you know, so have a beautiful evening. Au revoir.